Welcome to the third video in our Azure series. In this video, we will be discussing Azure best practices when it comes to network connectivity and highlight the difference between express route and VPN connections. When you provision a new Azure tenant, you have multiple options when it comes to on-premises to cloud network connectivity. VPN solutions include point-to-site and site-to-site options. Express route is commonly preferred for enterprise connectivity. Each connection method has certain advantages and disadvantages, in which we will highlight here. Azure VPN Gateway connects your on-premises networks to Azure via site-to-site -site VPNs in a similar way that you configure a remote branch office network topology. Point-to-site allows for remote worker connectivity as an individual. ExpressRoute provides the best level of enterprise level connectivity to Azure with redundant dual path connections essentially plugged straight into the Azure fabric through your service provider, local to the region where you operate your infrastructure. ExpressRoute also scales up to 10 gigabits per second with options to pay for just the connection and not traffic flow. If you are intending to push and pull massive data sets to Azure, then it will be more cost effective than a VPN solution that charges for egress and ingress usage. ExpressRoute also allows the routing of traffic intended for other Microsoft online services through the new Microsoft peering feature that has just merged with public peering. By using route filters on this connection, you can tunnel all of your Office 365 traffic through ExpressRoute, with the exception of services such as Skype for Business video calling. Dart 3 can assist you with selecting the most appropriate connection method into your Azure tenant, factoring in all of your business and technical requirements for network connectivity. If you have any specific questions in regards to this topic or any of our other topics, feel free to get in touch with Dart 3 directly.